Something that happens occasionally in your QuickBooks file is you'll end up with two accounts that are really the same account. They just, for whatever reason, your account's been duplicated. Maybe a bank account, an expense account, a revenue account. Um, really, any type, any type of account can be duplicated. And so you may end up with transactions in both accounts and you need to consolidate those into one. How, how do you do that without losing the transactions you have? Well, the easiest way is to merge them and I'm going to show you how to do that. So the first step in merging your accounts is to go to your chart of accounts. And so we're going to come down here to accounting. It's going to take us to our chart of accounts. Yes, we want to see our chart of accounts. Okay, now let's, uh, let's scroll down here and let's find an account that we can actually make a duplicate of so I can show you how to merge them. Um, so let's do let's do advertising so we can scroll back up here and we're gonna make a duplicate of advertising so let me exit out of this so we're gonna come down here let's see what our options are I'm gonna choose an expense account leave it on advertising and promotion and then let's just name it marketing. Okay, so we create our marketing account here. We'll close this. And now we've created the account. So now let's come to expenses. Let's do a new expense. Okay. Now let's choose a vendor. Um, I'll just choose a random one here. So let's do let's, this one. We're going to leave the date and everything else the same. And then here for account, let's scroll down and choose our, or actually let me just type in marketing. Okay. And I'll put $100.50 in here. And now we're going to save and close. So now we've created our transaction in our marketing account. Now let's go back to our chart of accounts. Scroll back down. Find our account here. Run our report. Exit out of this. And so now we see in the marketing account here's the transaction we just put in and now we realize oh no I've been putting all my marketing expenses into my advertising account I need this to go into advertising how do we do that well let's first scroll up here a little bit and advertising this is the account we want to keep so we have to look and see exactly how this account, how its name is spelled, because we need it exact. Now let's come back down to marketing. We'll click on our little arrow and we'll hit edit. And now we're going to change the name of our marketing account to advertising. The account that we want to get rid of, we're going to change it to the exact same name as the one we want to keep. And now QuickBooks says, oh no are you sure you want to do this there's already an account with this name you're going to merge the accounts yes yes that's exactly what we want to do so now we're back in our chart and let's scroll down a little bit here and you'll see we run our report on our advertising account and there is the transaction that we had initially put into marketing, we merged the accounts and it moved it directly into our advertising account. We didn't lose any data, we didn't lose anything else. Everything is exactly where it should be.